See, it's difficult to trade the market purely based on one data. I think the basic strategy in this market is that each individual needs to define their risk profile and define their approach. If you bought the election trade, which is that you bought into policy stocks, end of April, beginning of May, we are, I mean, I would say that it's time to take some chips off the table. If you have invested in some of the CAPEX stocks or defense stocks or railway stocks for next three to five years, trust me, nothing will change, barring volatility, which you should be prepared for. If your time horizon is six months plus, I guess the economy is in a good down, is in an uptrend. Election cycle may have an impact in the near term, but eventually it's the economy and earnings which would really matter. And that on that account, I can there are bargains in the market. Similarly, if you're a hand on a hard trader, and if you're sitting on some cash, I think it's time to buy some protection or you know raise some cash. So that just like one shoe does not fit all, you cannot look at a perfect strategy. It really has to be for it really has to be a function of your risk, your expected returns, and how much volatility can you digest. But if you would have asked me last Friday, I would have said that the market positioning was looking uh, was looking slightly extended. But in last two or three days, especially this week. Uh, Things are not simmering the way they were. FIs are stashed short. Mm. HNI investors they've started cutting. Uh, mm. They've started booking profits. Mm. Modi stocks or the policy stocks have seen a mild profit booking, and there is no large built up in the FNO market. So net net the market positioning is neutral to anxious mm. rather than bullish and excited. See uh, the way I look at it is that whether there is continuity or not. So it's like in binary outcome which markets would focus on. Now whether it is 310 or 320 or 350, in democracy what really matters is that as long as you have a comfortable majority, then you will extend with all the policy reforms. Now optically you can argue mm -hmm. and say okay 310 is better than 320, 320 is certainly lower than 330. Mm -hmm. So all that narrative actually is just, just meaningless narrative purely from a market standpoint. 